I'm one of those who agreed with the boys in the ranks that you were the GI general. And now that we have unification, there's no more important task than the commander that comes in to be the first chairman permanently of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. I believe that by having a chairman, we can greatly improve the efficiency of the Joint Chiefs of Staff and our strategic planning and other duties with which we're charged. I must admit that I take this position with somewhat mixed feeling because in a way it takes me away from the men and women of the Army who have been so loyal and helpful to me in carrying out my duties, not only as Chief of Staff, but in the years gone by.